हेलो फिजियोस आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू आर चैनल फिजियो विद्यापीठ वी आर बैक विद अवर नेक्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन हीट थेरेपी और थर्मोथेरेपी वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट वर्ल पूल बात ओके सो इट इज अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट टेक्निक बाय विच वी कैन अप्लाई द थर्मोथेरेपी और हीट थेरेपी ऑल्सो इट कैन गिव कोल्ड थेरेपी ओके दैट इज इट कैन बी इधर कोल्ड वर्ल्ड पूल और वार्म वर्ल्ड पूल सो माई नेम इज विजय कुमार एंड लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सी वर्ल पूल बार इट इज अ टैंक दैट कंटेन वॉटर विद टर्बाइन सो डेफिनेटली देर विल बी अ टैंक ओके देर विल बी सम वॉटर इन साइड इट येस एंड एट वन साइड देर विल बी अ टर्बाइन एंड वट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ दैट टर्बाइन दैट टर्बाइन will produce the movement of water okay to produce the movement of water through agitation and aeration that is it will move water and also put some air inside it okay which will produce a lot of turbulence which make it enable to either assist or resist movement so let us suppose the turbulence is produced in this direction and if we place our uh, distal part in it and move in that direction definitely it will assist the motion and if we move it against the direction of turbulence it will resist the motion so it can be used as assistance as well as resistance also which is a very good method to do exercise in our previous lectures where we studied about hot pack contrast bar okay so there first of all in hot pack movement was not permissible but here movement is also permissible also we can have assistance as well as resistance okay which is a very good important feature of the extremity or whole extremity or lower trunk okay so that is different different parts can be immersed so what are its type types it can be extremity tank you can see it is used for extremities such as upper limb as well as lower limb that is the distal part okay and its capacity is 40 uh, 10 to 45 gallon okay low boil tank and high boil tank both of them are used for uh, immersion up to the waist level but in low boil the position of patient is in sitting that is long sitting but in high boil it is standing position okay and high boil tank is also called hip or leg tank next is the haba tank it is the full body immersion and its capacity is very high that is 200 to 400 which was 75 to 105 and 60 to 105 gallon in low boil and high boil and it is up to 2 uh, to 4 times high in the haba tank and it come in three different uh, shapes rectangular figure of eight and butterfly each of them has its own benefit okay after studying about different types of whirlpool bath we can just focus that what actually the term whirlpool mean it is the turbulence which is produced by the jet of stream which is produced by electrical pump which mixes air and water and that turbulence is used as assistance as well as resistance that i have explained you already okay so this is the etiological meaning next uh, what are the parts stainless steel tank then a turbine then a mixing tap or thermostat which will give us desired temperature either it can be cold whirlpool or warm whirlpool cold whirlpool is having temperature about 0 to 26 and warm is at about 36 to 41 degree celsius okay and next it is very simple uses okay so this use is very important which is wound debridement debridement mean it is the cleaning that is cleaning of wound okay so here uh, if there is a any kind of wound on our distal part okay we can easily put it into the extremity tank and after we can after that we can allow the turbine to produce agitation and that agitation will definitely uh, remove all the dirty particle from the wound that is our wound will become clean okay next is pain relief according to pain gate mechanism then mobilize stiff joint that is it can uh, the turbulence will force the joint to get move okay so mobilize the stiff joint then facilitate range of motion either by its assisting function or by resisting function next is muscle spasm and that is also i have 
explained in the therapeutic effect part okay so that is why here uses i am doing it i am explaining it bit fastly and if you are not getting these points you can just watch my uh, two three previous lecture where i have explained therapeutic effect in one lecture with complete description okay next is advantage it can be used for heating effect exercise and for wound debridement this is one of the most important part why because in our uh, heating pad we can just apply heat but here we can give heat we can do exercise we can get our wound clean so three important functions are done in a single thing okay allow patient's comfort then weaker muscles can be exercised effectively allow the movement along with heating unlike other modality that i have explained then disadvantages they are self understood that is a large amount of water is required there will be problem regarding cleaning okay and there will be risk of spread of infection size of tank limits is used yes if they, you can you will see habar tank it is very large it will occupy a large space and definitely large amount of water will be used so it will become uh, it will not be cost effective for us okay then cost of cleaning and heating is more okay so how you can apply this you can just on the machine okay you can fill water then set the temperature start the turbine okay and you can place the body part into a comfortable position also you can add some amount of antimicrobial agent which are uh, important to prevent any kind of spread of infection okay so this is all about the whirlpool bath in our next lecture we will study about another important modality of heating so till then you keep on studying thank you to one and all